Hey guys, it's me, John Avario here, and in today's video, if you saw from the intro, it is the photo trip series. So last week I went to Longwood Gardens with my school, it was a senior trip, so all the seniors went. And then Saturday I went to Washington with my photography class. It was so much fun, and I want to show you some videos, uh, some videos and photos that I took. So let's go! So... But they started with Longwood Gardens for the first trip. And if you see from these beautiful flowers, it's like really tropical, really botanical flowers. Most of them were like tropical islander flowers from like Puerto Rico, Hawaii, Dominican Republic, Colombia, like really like tropical areas. And those are so beautiful. And I was so grateful to go with all the seniors of the horticulture class. So that was so much fun. And I just love taking photos of flowers, like the textures and like the colors of the flowers. Not just that, they also have bonsai, and I didn't know that you can pretty much bonsai any type of tree. Like they had oak tree, they had cherry tree, stuff like that to bonsai, and it was like so crazy. Not just that, my friend Aubrey got dressed out, so I did a little photo shoot with her, if you guys see. She kind of dressed out, kind of like tropical y not just that, it kind of gave me like fairy vibes, so I went like, for example, Tinkle Bell, like Disney-ish, and I loved them, like, Love the photos I took with her. She really loved it. She's like, oh my God, we had to do a photo shoot. And that's what I did with her. Not just that, you could say I had a photo apprentice because Andrew wanted to take some photos. So I let my friend Andrew borrow one of my cameras. He took some photos. And you know, I love showing my friends how to do photography. They'll get into it because of me as well. And it was just so much fun. And just like, I would teach him how to do stuff. He was really interested. So that was so cool. Not just that, I was, he took a lot of photos of me. And this is one embarrassing photo here. I looked at so awful, my eyes were closed, and I was like, uh. Not just that, they had beautiful architecture, like the buildings, the way they did the water fountains, and like the hedges, like the way they did the hedges, the mazes with the grass, it was just so beautiful. And if you're in the Pennsylvania area, I would say Longwood Gardens is the best place. Not just that, also it's really good for neurodiverse people because it's a big space, so even though it's a lot of people, it's not that bad. And now, after that, I'm going to show you the photos and videos that I took at the Wishahickon. So, Saturday, I went with my group to the Wishahickon, and I was able to use that amazing zoom lens that one of my mentors let me borrow. And I was able to get up close to every little detail of the plants and flowers and botanical life. And I felt like, if you ever play Legend of Zelda or, like, The Last of Us, one of those games with especially Legend of Zelda, I felt like I was in one of those magical wars like Legend of Zelda. I was able to get up close with stuff. And, like, I don't know, I felt, like, really fantasy ass and it was so much fun. Not just that, I didn't know the Wish I could have it, but it had horses! And I was like, oh my god, horses! And me and Dustin were freaking out because we saw the horses. And we was able to pet them. And we was able to feed them also. And it was, oh my god, the Wish of Hicken had horses. It was like so amazing. I didn't know a place like that would have horses. And I'm able to take photos up close of them right now. And I was able to get some really amazing shots of the horses. Details, the mane, the fur, the skin, the eye. Like really in depth of the horse. Not just that, they also have beautiful creeks. So we took some photos near the creek. And I just love like the way water flows and stuff. It's so meditation. And then Sally, we saw a fish and how mm -hmm. Destiny tried to help the fish the best she can, but it didn't want to move. So Sally, the fish did not made it, but RIP to fish, he was a rare one and he tried to survive. He was the toughest. And then later we saw geese. And I know maybe why fish didn't want to move it because geese were there. And then we saw a crawfish and everyone was like, oh my God, it's a crawfish. Like, it's so cool. I was able to get photos up close with it and stuff, but I never see stuff like this. So the good thing about the Wachahicka that's in Pennsylvania, you get to see stuff like that. And then we had a long hike away. Destiny. This is one hell of a hike. So pretty. During the hike, I took some amazing photos and I was just infatuated with like the statues. They had like stone bridges and stuff and I took a lot of 
of some close-up detail of like the architecture and like the stones and i feel like it's always mesmerizing to take photos up close of like nature like this because it's like that's how animals see nature and i just love seeing the point of view of how animals see nature and how they zoom not just that like bugs insects like any type of life form see nature it's like so amazing and so cool and i was so happy to go to a washington hicker and i took a photo of this beautiful catbird not just that they had amazing park rangers and scouts that taught us so much stuff and i went with destiny destiny had a fun time me and her both laugh we had fun walking and here's some videos of us walking and having fun Hey guys, so that was pretty much the video for this week. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun going out with friends and going to like these cool places. And I can't wait to do more of these videos. And I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching me and supporting me. And stay tuned for next week's video. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I love you guys so much. And I'll see you soon. Bye.